Hi, this is Jonesy with Jetters Northwest, and I want to talk about GPM and PSI. It's always a subject we talk about. You know, with PSI, that really tells you the speed, the velocity that the water's coming out of the nozzle, but it says nothing about how much water and what kind of an impact it can have. I want to use these kettlebells to kind of compare. We have a 10-pound bell and a 5-pound bell. Obviously, the 10-pound bell is twice as massive. And the same goes for if you had, say, a 10-gallon per minute jetter versus a 5-gallon per minute jetter. It's going to have more impact, and it's going to hit an area that's larger, which is very important when you're jetting larger pipe. As I drop these, you see the 5-pounder has an impact. The 10-pounder has a greater impact, but it also has a larger impact area. And that's what gallons per minute can do for you with hydrojetting.